Thanks, Renee. I really appreciate and acknowledge all that hard work you've done on the project. Thanks, Greg. Hopefully we can get to collaborate on further rewarding work-based initiatives. I know you've already indicated no, but let me ask you again. Would you like to come back to my place for a date? Mmm. Now, what do we notice went wrong there? The acting. Hmm? Neither wearing lanyards. More in terms of behaviour. Greg overstepped accepted workplace boundaries. Exactly. And that can happen so easily, whether in terms of unwanted advances, racist or sexist language, or casual body shaming. You said this wouldn't be about me. All right. Any questions? Yep. Do Renee and Greg end up together? Spoiler! So, are we done? Yes. Great. With the theory, let's put it into practice. Time for some role-playing scenarios. Let's set the scene. Come on, come on, come on. Have a seat. That's it. It's a busy office. We're all working very hard. This'll be a stretch. Now, you are? Ash. No, think of a role-play name. Randy. Not a porn name. All right. Niroshina. Sorry, what? It's my dad's name. That's nice. What about Dale? Dale is going to walk over to... Kim. Probably not. Jenny? Yes, Jenny. Now, let's hear an acceptable workplace exchange. Hi, Jenny. Can you finish this report? I'm a little busy right now, thanks, Dale. Sure. No problems. That was perfect! Uh, well done, guys. Sorry, sorry. But nothing got done. Are you not seeing the point? Of an office? No one was offended or made to feel uncomfortable. Or fat? Yes. Making for a stronger, happier, more productive workplace. But we haven't produced.